What is up everybody and welcome back to my little corner of YouTube here where it is time to level me up. I of course am a Loke, aka King Loki Bear. And uh, yeah, it's Friday, end of the week, had a crazy week. I was thinking to myself, Sabretooth is available. He looks pretty sick right there, you know, he looks pretty awesome. So let's check out this animalistic crystal. I got some units to burn. Let's try for 20. Let's see if we get it. You know what I'm saying? That, that's kind of my whole pro thought process this morning. So, uh, yeah. I think I'm going to start off by spinning the first, you know, five. Then maybe popping some. Maybe spinning some more. I don't know. We'll see what happens from there. You know what I mean? So, with these crystals, you get a chance for Bishop or Sabretooth. Plus everybody else that's in, you know, like the featured pool. So that's like Sentinel, Void, um, God, everybody. Like, everybody's in that pool. There was a quick look at the drop right there. Pretty slim chance. I feel like my luck has gotten so much worse since the drop rate has come out. Like, I, like, I don't know if you remember, but there was that one video where I got like Hulk Ragnarok, Void. I've gotten so many blades recently. And uh, then they released the drop rate. Now it's like three star, three star, three star. Nothing but the three star. And if I do get a five star, it's like Magneto or Black Panther. I think the last five star I got was Black Panther Civil Warrior. And I was like, meh. I mean, he's got his place in. Oh, well, there's a hood. There's a hood. Awakened him. Not too shabby. But, uh, of course, he's a four-star, so odds are I may never use him. Like, I may not even rank this guy up, unless it's, like, a level-up event that I need. I need a couple extra levels out of, you know? Um, but what I was saying was, was that Black Panther Civil Warrior, like, I mean, I'll use him for, like, AW defense, maybe? Maybe? If I actually, like, needed to? I feel like we already got, like, two or three of them in our, in our battle group. Um... So it's not really necessary, you know? So he's just going to be more arena fodder, you know? I don't want a 5-star that's going to be arena fodder. I want a 5-star that I want to use, I want to play, you know? That I like. Good old X-23. Getting me extra crystals. Gotta love that. Alright, so we just spun 5. The only good one out of that was Hood, so I'm popping these. Looking at it real quick, got a couple four stars, got that green goblin there, I'm happy about that. Got a Hyperion, nice. So I think, I think green goblin's just getting awakened, I could be wrong though. Oh no, he, he was awakened. Shows how much I use him, you know what I mean? He's a really good character, but I just never use him. Hyperion I use on the other hand all the time. Glad his ability has gotten to 70. Oh, there's the first offer. Let's get rid of that. All right, so let's spin these last five, I think. See Sabretooth in there a couple times. Just kind of letting that one spin out, see what I get. And it is going to be... Oh. Well, three-star bishop. I mean, eh, there you go. There's something. Um, I think I awakened his ability with a stone, because I just had, like, a bunch in the last item use. I was just like, I'm just going to awaken everybody. So, in other news, Alliance Wars Season 1, almost over. What are you guys' thoughts? God, I, uh, so our alliance jumped all over the place. So, like, we, uh, kind of broke up from the Reservoir Dogs, and, uh, we merged in with this other one, Pim's Super Soldiers or something like that. And, uh, man, we just could not get along with them. There was just so much crap. They, uh, they kind of overtalked the, what they could do. They were, like, hyping themselves up too much. And then we got into AQ, Map 5, Day 5, and just, like, they could not clear the first section. So it turned into a thing. And then we, uh, joined up with another group and kind of formed our own alliance. Started at the bottom. And, uh... Yeah, over the course of the last month, we uh, we ranked up all the way up to gold three. 
pretty damn solid. Pretty damn solid for, you know, one month. And, uh, Alliance War season almost over, so hopefully next season, gonna get up to, uh, something better. Not sure exactly what, maybe Platinum, for sure. But, uh, what do you guys think about this one month break? So, Alliance War season ends, season one ends, and then the next one doesn't start till May 2nd. What? What is that about? Like, Alliance War is one of my favorite parts of this game. The player versus player aspect of it is just so much fun. Ugh. Another three star. Nothing really solid on that last half. Ugh. But, uh, yeah, so. Let me know your thoughts, because I'd love to hear it in the comments down below. Or, of course, you can message me in game, King Loki Bear. Got some good pulls. Got some shards. Got some ISO, probably gonna sell all that for gold because we got a massive gold problem up in here. But yeah, thanks so much for stopping by everybody. I really appreciate it. Definitely hit that like button, hit that uh, share button, and uh, come back next week. I'm gonna be saving up all my uh, shard crystals throughout the week from arenas and everything else that I do. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna do an opening every Friday from here on out, probably till the end of summer. So yeah, definitely stop by for that sometime whenever you get a chance. You know what I mean? But uh, yeah, until next time, I will catch you then.